guys happy sunday evening someone here stole my seat as i was working on my computer right you like mommy's seat baby yeah should we go out jackson should we go out in a little bit yeah and then before you know it it will be time to um shower and everything and get ready for tomorrow morning we have transplant appointments and so yeah i'm not a morning person you guys probably know that by now and so mornings are a bit tough so i try and shower the night before and just get my meds together and kind of just get everything all ready hey guys we just finished having some delicious homemade chicken soup and um yeah jackson's gonna get his version of our dinner right as a little snack for you because you didn't get many treats today Mommy saved this just for you, baby. Okay, so here's his little snack. I guess you could say a little treat. And he's very excited. He's been patiently waiting on the rug over there. Is that good, Jack? Do you like that? So he's got some chicken, carrots, a few pieces of celery, some little pastina, and some chicken broth. You guys heard him drinking the broth. I think it's safe to say he's enjoying it. Guys, so I have a surprise here for Jill on the computer. Somebody sent her a message. She's wondering what the heck is going on, but I'm just gonna okay. hand her the computer. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> that is so cool for me. For you, yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's Chris Sullivan, aka Toby, if you guys watch Toby this. From is this us. is us. He is one of our Absolute favorites. favorites. Rather our favorite, I should say. Everybody plays a good part, but he always like makes us die laughing. I can only imagine what is <laughs> in this message. Okay. Jillian Monticello, how are you? I got a little message. I've been chatting with my uh, my buddy Rosario. <laughs> um, and he sent me a message about this incredible woman in his life, Jillian. Um, he says that you've been dealing your whole life with uh, cystic fibrosis and, and the complications surrounding um, that disease, but that you've you've light you've lit up his life in a way and shown him what it means to be resilient and strong in a way that is uh, indescribable. He could barely, it took a lot of messages. We, we've been messaging quite a bit. We're good buddies now. Um, <laughs> wow. To, he had to, he had to, he had to message me many, many times to, to get across what you mean to him. I know you just had a uh, kidney uh, transplant and your friend Liz was uh, amazing enough to donate a kidney uh, to the procedure. Sure was. I mean, it sounds like you were surrounded by people who love you so, so much. Um, and yeah, I guess I guess you got a birthday coming up too, right? <laughs> Maybe soon. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Um, you that was so great. Special lady. Rosario sounds like a very lucky uh, guy. At least he, he sounds like it when I talk about him. <laughs> He's full of life and love, um, especially for you. Um, I hope you're doing well. Stay safe. Stay healthy. Stay sane. This uh, crazy, crazy time. Have a good day. Oh, that was so, so cool. Wow. <laughs> Isn't that cool? Wow. That is beyond cool. Like, <laughs> that was really so sweet of him to take yeah, the really time was. out of his day and, um, yeah, reach out. That was just really so nice. He might see this video, too. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, Chris, <laughs> thank you so, so much for this amazing video. It was so nice um, of you to take the time out of your day to send me a special message. And um, I really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, and thank you for going back and forth with my husband. It sounds <laughs> like I hope he didn't torture you too much. <laughs> hope not. But um, thank you for going above and beyond and putting a huge smile on my face. And um we can't wait to turn on This Is Us in a little while. It's kind of like a ritual that we do every night. We're trying to just catch up. We're about like half a season behind. So yeah, we'll see you on there. <laughs> Jillian Monatello, how are you? I got a little message. I've been chatting with my, uh, my buddy Rosario. 
Um, and he sent me a message about this incredible woman in his life, Jillian. Um, he says that you've been dealing your whole life with um, cystic fibrosis and, and the complications surrounding um, that disease, but that you've you've light you've lit up his life in a way and shown him what it means to be resilient and strong in a way that is uh, indescribable. He could barely, it took a lot of messages. We've, we've been messaging quite a bit. We're good buddies now. Um, to, he had to, he had to, he had to message me many, many times to, to get across what you mean to him. I know you just had a kidney um, transplant and your friend Liz was uh, amazing enough to donate a kidney um, to the procedure. I mean, with, I mean, it sounds like you are surrounded by people who love you so, so much. Um, and yeah, I guess, you, I guess you got a birthday coming up too, right? Maybe soon. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Jillian. Happy birthday to you. Um, you sound like a very special lady. And Rosario sounds like a very lucky uh, guy. Um, at least he, he sounds like it when I talk, when I talk to him, he's, uh, he's full of life and love, um, especially for you. Um, I hope you're doing well, stay safe, stay healthy, stay sane in this, uh, crazy, crazy time. Have a good day. Hey guys, we are going to head to sleep, but, uh, tonight Rosario surprised me with an amazing video that was really cool to see. And, um, I will put it into this vlog. If I don't put it before this, it'll be after. Um, Rosario reached out to one of our favorite um, actors, Chris Sullivan, and um, he responded. Yeah, he is from This Is Us, and he's been in quite a few other movies and things like that. And so, yeah, we were not expecting a response. Well, rather, I wasn't involved. Rosario wasn't expecting a response. But um, he did get a response, and um, it was pretty awesome that he made that video and reached out. So if you guys are fans, uh, be sure to watch it. It will be in this vlog. Thank you guys for watching, and um, yeah, we will see you guys tomorrow on the road to the transplant appointment. Good night. Here he comes. Jackson. Jackson has his dentist stick, and he is ready for bed. guys happy monday night i look a bit disheveled i'm pretty tired me too we had early um appointments today we had blood work me tree <laughs> and um transplant appointment and thank god all went well so far um we uh did blood work so we'll wait for those results and um then we came home and just did laundry and a little cleaning here and there and what else what else did we do we went to McDonald's and got a chicken sandwich coffee at and some coffee. Nothing crazy, but just uh, some things we enjoy. And now we're having some homemade chicken soup for dinner. Here's the soup. We made it a couple of days ago, so it's still good. I think it was yesterday. Oh, yesterday. Yeah, oh, it was yeah, yesterday. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm losing it. Yes, yeah, so it was yesterday. So we're just having some more. <clears throat> we wanted something quick and easy to make. And so, yeah. Rosario also did I worked something on, cool today. I uh, worked on some Pokemon stuff today. Put some cards uh, in my, P uh, not PSA, CGC submission, which is another company. And I'm going to send those off tomorrow. And so pretty much what they do is they look at the condition of your card. And then they um, they give it a grade. Yeah, and the higher the grade, time. the more money it's worth, pretty yeah. much. I think it's Tuesday night. It is Tuesday night. It is. <laughs> We've just been doing a ton of cleaning. We it's cleaned not the day car. Yet. It's not hump day yet. Um, we were cleaning the car, then cleaning out a bunch of things. But anyway, um, today I got the blood work results from yesterday's transplant blood work. And my white um, blood count is kind of low. So um, we're starting on, I believe this is Neupogen. It's... Um, I can't see it on the camera yet. Oh. So 
my white blood count is low and so they started me on some Neupogen. Uh, I never took this before. I did take Redicrit in the past for the red blood cells, but this is for to increase the white blood cells. So um, yeah, it's one of these for three days. So we're gonna start first dose now. It's pretty nifty uh, needle. Yeah, this reminds me of the um, the blood thinner one. Yeah, yeah, the um, Lovenox. The Lovenox, yes, exactly. It's the same setup as Lovenox. Cool. So, yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Guys, happy Thursday evening. We're just having some coffee. Um, or Thursday night, I should say. It's almost 8 o'clock. Um, I haven't really vlogged in quite some time. Um, after taking those injections, I was having a lot of muscle pain. And um, by last night, that started getting a lot better. But I've just been more exhausted today. I know that can happen with these injections. It is Neupogen, and it's supposed to increase my white blood cell count since it's kind of pretty low right now. And so, yeah, just having side effects and not really feeling um, great. I mean, of course, I'm okay, but just um, tired and just like fatigued and stuff. So that's why we haven't really been vlogging much. But um, yeah, I figured I'd make it out for some coffee and um, we have to just run to the bank. And that, that's really it, just to, uh, just to get some air. <gasps> Whoa, Whoa, Jack. Smoke. He's eating good in the neighborhood, right? Jack, that's a big puppuccino before dinner. <laughs> you have to have your dinner first. Yum. Oh, this is so good. Nom, 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 nom. This is delicious. Oh, I'm going to stick my whole nose in there. Hey, guys. It's dinner time. We have not touched these chickens on the stone pan. And let's see if it can easily move with no oil. Oh wow, look at that. Wow, that is crazy. With no oil. I'm gonna flip it. Bam. If you guys are wondering what that noise is, our rice is going bananas right now. Look at that. Wow, that's nice. Wow, that's actually yeah. really cool. Yeah, that is. It's that's actually like nice. grilling it nicely. Wow. The finished product, very simple but delicious. Come on guys, mine looks better with the French. No, All right. Kidding. Balsamic vinegar is good. Sometimes it just gets me, like the yeah, yeah. bitterness. I was like, you know what? We already had the sauce made. Hey guys, happy Saturday evening. I didn't get to vlog at all today. Um, but anyway, it's dinner time. I'm just sauteing some garlic with oil, and then I'm going to throw some spinach in there. And Rosario's going to be in charge of making some steaks. We had a few things to do today. Um, we had an order to deliver of Pokemon cards, so that was pretty cool. And then I also, we went to see my pediatric CF doctor and um, I had some extra meds that were still, um, the due date wasn't for a while, the expiration date on it. And so I wasn't gonna be able to use everything before it expires and so we brought some. And um, yeah, she hopefully could give it to someone that doesn't have insurance or um, doesn't have a way of getting the medications, you know, to afford them since they're very expensive. And so it would just be nice um, for someone else to be able to use them. Nice. Mm. Well guys, dinner is served. This looks really good. We had one um, scalloped potato left, so we shared it. I really didn't want many cobs. I just wanted some protein and veggies. So I'll just have a little taste and he's got the same. Mm. 